Hello. Today I wanted to talk about the Filofax Heritage. This is an A5 uh, and it's my favourite minimalist organiser and it's quite compact so it's a thin organiser in my terminology. So Filofax Heritage A5, it's leather, there's no closing mechanism. This is the brown version, there's also a black version. The current price is 159 euros. Size is 180 millimeters wide, 233 millimeters in height, 28 millimeters depth. And the ring size for this version is 15 millimeters. So it's uh, very small, very compact. Uh, being the compact version, it's smaller than many other A5 organizers which have pockets. So, for example, if I take uh, this one, which is a Simple Stories, uh, rather a bulky A5, you can see how much bigger that one is than the um, Heritage. And if I look at a Lockwood, Filofax Lockwood, which is a fairly compact A5 version, so you can see it's smaller than the Simply Stories one. Again, the heritage is a little smaller. I hope you can see that. I'll put them like this so you have a better idea. So you can see because the rings are smaller and there are no um, pockets, that it's a very compact organizer. Um, there's also no pen loop. Um, the leather on the outside is uh, has texture as you would expect. There's nothing on here except for the logo, the Filofax logo on the uh, spine. Uh, the inside though is smooth, been smoothed, so it makes a really ideal writing surface. So this is a very good minimalist organizer for writing. And because there is no pockets on the inside, on the left or on the right, right or left-handed, you can use it either way. Um, so to compensate for there being no pockets, the heritage includes a fly leaf. And unfortunately, this is where the problems with this organizer start. Uh, this fly leaf has, let me just take it out for you, <clears throat> it has a pocket, a business card size pocket on the front, very useful potentially, and on the back it has pockets which go one pocket at the top, I hope you can see that, and one at the bottom. So these, these can be used for any papers you have because you no longer have the opportunity to store those in the sides of your organiser. Um, but there are problems. The, the holes are very small, so it tends to stick when you're turning it. This, this is, it's not really easy. It's not too bad, but it's, it's, it doesn't, the holes could have been a little bigger. And it's bulky, considering how small these rings are, this is actually quite thick because it's two layers of leather thick. So, um, yeah, I, I find it too bulky really for such a, a slim um, organizer. But the real issue is the pen loop. Uh, this looks to me very much like a production error. And I can't really understand why Filofax went ahead and sold them anyway, instead of correcting this problem. The pen loop enters a slit on the front and on the back. So it is occupied by part of the flyleaf sticking out. My theory is that the intention was to put the uh, pen loop between the two layers of leather here or both ends of the pen loop on this side or both ends of the pen loop on this side. 
As it is, it's not really useful at all. If I take a, a pen, thick pen, this is a 10 millimeter diameter pen, I really struggle to get this in. In fact, I really have to force this in. No, it's not gonna go, there we are. I have to force this in to get it in. And what happens is if you try to have the pen sitting outside the paper size as you would normally do, it completely deforms the fly leaf because it's pushing this, it's pushing this, this side of the fly leaf in, it completely folds everything up. It's, it's, it doesn't work. If you take a thinner pen, this one is eight millimeters in diameter, that's okay. Again, you cannot put it on the outside. It deforms the fly leaf. You can have it on the front or you can have it at the back, but it still pulls at the leather. It doesn't look right. I cannot believe that this was actually designed like this. I think it's an error. So this basically, in my view, makes this fly leaf useless. What I have done is I have discarded the flyleaf and I am now using this uh, flyleaf which is the um, organizer pen holder which you can buy for 15 euros 80 at the current time. This is thinner, the, the, this plastic film is much thinner on the rings and it has just as much utility and the pen loop has been properly designed. So for me, this is a better solution. And I love this color combination, by the way. So yeah, what a shame that that's happened. Considering the, considering this is just, just a leather folder, that's all it is, it's one piece of leather with some rings on it. And considering the price, I don't really understand why it was released with such a badly designed pen loop. But file effects have a very bad reputation for, bad, for pen loops in my eyes. So, um, as you can see, the heritage lies open. It doesn't try and spring back and it lies flat. So this is a, a very good uh, organizer for writing, for utility. The personal size are also very nice. I lust after the personal size. I haven't got one yet. I'm trying to resist. I may end up weakening and getting them anyway. But so this is my favorite minimalist organizer. Uh, I think it's very nice. You might consider it if you're looking for something which doesn't have all of these pockets, but do bear in mind that the uh, fly leaf is not really very good. Okay, thanks. I hope this was helpful. See you next time.